How's it going, everyone? I'm FeatherGamer55, and welcome back to more Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. Okay, in the previous episode, we tried to fight a giant rock. We got wrecked. We got rocked. And it was a lot of fun. We also did this shrine right here, the Bosch Kala, and it was pretty cool. And yeah, so we beat that. And now I guess we're just gonna keep making our way over there, or should we... I wanna climb back up this mountain first. I wanna just get an idea of some things. Yeah, see, I wanna climb up here. I just wanna get some height just to see if there's anything I can get to first. Before I'm all of a sudden... I don't know. Try wasting or missing out on something I could do right away here. I see a tower over there. But I don't want to travel that far for a tower, so. No, I don't see any other shrines hanging around here. So we have the shrine that's. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There's a shrine. There's another shrine. Okay, so let's mark these. Let's do these real quick. Okay, well. I want to try to make my way to this shrine first. Forget Kakariko, I want to just keep going to these shrines right now. I want to get more spirit orbs. Okay, East Post of Ruins. Oh, hello. Let me just sneak up on these guys. That's the best way. Wow, that's a lot. Oh, I could... Wait, do I have fire arrows? No, I have an ice arrow. Ice isn't going to be what I want, though. I want to take out the blue one. It didn't work. Oh, here they come. Oh my goodness. Guy was getting right in my face. Ow. Wow, there are a lot of them. Wait, what? Oh, I, I made a mistake here. Perfect. Much better plan. So much better. I mean, now there's like a huge fire, but... I just killed all of that guy's friends. Oh, that was worth it. I wonder if that is still on fire. No. Hang on, I need a weapon. He just goes to dance again? Are you kidding me? I just killed all your friends. And left a fire sitting right here. This guy's crazy. And I'm probably gonna die. Let me eat. Because I, man, the problem with the claymores is how slow they are. Um. Oh wow, that gives me five health. And a movement. That's good. So eat that. What's a recipe? I will herb. Oh. It's pretty cool when it tells you.
There we go, that's stupid. Oh, that is gonna be very good. A broadsword. Give that to me. Thank you. Broadsword will be so good to have. Take that. Perfect. I love faster weapons. That's perfect. Okay, that was definitely... Ooh, that was a... Uh, do I have any bows I could just throw away that I don't want? Drop. Drop. I'll keep one Boko bow. Man, they have some good stuff here. Okay, well, wasn't that fun? We uh, killed some guys. It's always a good time. What was I doing? Oh, right, I was heading toward a shrine, but I kind of got sidetracked on that one. It was worth it. I got a really good weapon now. Got that traditional Zelda feel of a weapon. And I definitely don't want to use it yet. Wait, who's... Th Are you throwing rocks at me, dude? Okay. Oh, another camp. But they're sleeping in this one. Perfect. Oh, but there is a guy on guard. Okay. Okay, so I gotta do this in a way where he doesn't see me, but I can sneak up on him. Maybe I should get a better weapon out. Or no weapon for a second, just so I'm not having a weapon. How did I miss that? Got him. Okay, so what kind of weapon would be good? Let's, uh, this seems kind of harsh. Oh, look at that, finding rupees. Give me that. 20 rupees. Five rupees. They're throwing rocks at me. Well, that was worth it. Look at that, I got rupees. I didn't even know if rupees were in the game. I wasn't sure. Blackened crab, okay, that's good. Yeah, you know, you know what, I, I'll take some crab. Crab is good, I, lo I love crab, it's so good. What can I get in here? An opal, okay. Oh, screw it. Now I want to break these, because if I got rupees in one thing... Nah, just a bunch of apples. I mean, I'll take a bunch of apples, too. And some arrows, too. Like, this is all good supplies to just kind of be taking. So, yeah, I'll definitely take them. Alright. Uh, yeah, I'll take the uh, fangs and horns. Alright. Back on my mission. To this shrine. Man, it takes so long to get to a shrine because it gets so sidetracked. Are these fireflies? What is this? Can 
Can I shoot one? Oh, I can. Wow, okay, I just blew up a firefly. I'm not sure how to feel about that. Oh, dear. What is this? What did I walk into? I found the shrine. Yeah, that's great. Is this a raft? I found a whole... Oh my goodness, don't tell me this is a home for Bokoblin. Because I'm going to be in trouble. I'm going to infiltrate in this episode. We're doing it. But this is going to be troublesome. Okay. Riverside's... Oh no, it's not bad. It's a stable. Oh, <gasps> horses. Wait, 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 wait. wait. Saw something. What's old? Okay, Link. So this isn't a bad place. It's also by a shrine, too. Goats! There's goats! Look at this pretty guy. Look at him. Kiss me. No! Oh, I'm good. Oh no, I found cuckoos. At least I think so. I don't know, they look kind of more like just roosters. Not gonna kill anything. Th that's his heart. These are someone's animals. Whose animals are these? Woodcutter axe. I kind of actually need one. Here, I'll be nice and I'll leave mine here. Because it's like badly damaged. It's broken, <laughs> never mind. But I do need an axe. Okay, well, I want to get in here. Who works here? Who owns this place? Oh, there's a lot of people. I could go for a bite. Oh, customer, are you traveling alone? This inn gets full of beauty, or full marks for beauty, so I highly recommend taking a rest here. The river here makes you for some lovely scenery, and if you head northeast from here, you'll find a millennial sandbar. The scenery there is every bit as lovely as the scenery here. I'm something of a concierge, a uh, beauty, you see? I simply cannot resist a beautiful sight. <laughs> I try to exude, exude this in all things, not least in my own beautiful appearance. Speaking of, uh, speaking of, has anyone ever told you you have the most beautiful features? Dude, are you flirting with me? Uh, I do have many fond memories of this beautiful land. If you have the time, would you indulge me? Sure. Oh, you would? Even more beautiful on the inside. Now let's see. If you head north through Hyrule Fo Field, you'll see the castle surrounded by that foul aura. It has long been a den of monsters, but in its glory days, it was surely a thing of wondrous beauty. It was in that very castle in those very days that my ancestors, or ancestor, hmm, my grandfather's grandfather, I believe. Anyway, he's worked as the castle's appointed chef. I couldn't believe it myself. Oh, I wonder what sort of cuisine members of the royal court enjoyed in those good old days. As a child, I would often suffer meager meals, all while dreaming of the beautiful dishes that might have graced my plate. Oh, if only things had been different. Gourmet spiced meat, seafood curry, mushroom risotto, egg pudding. Oh my, I think I'm salivating, and it's my pursuit of those childhood dreams that explains the fabulous body you see here. These days I enjoy my time working at these stables, sharing my tales of beauty with any traveler willing to listen. But, I still wonder what could have been... Anyway, excuse me, I seem to have caught myself prattling on. But looking upon your perfect, perfectly symmetrical face and discussing me to beauty has rekindled my desire. If you should happen to set foot inside Hyrule Castle, could you find it in you to keep an eye out for a cookbook? There must be one lying around somewhere in there. I'm simply dying to finally sample the food of the royal court. Yeah. A side quest. Okay, royal recipe. I will make sure you get that cookbook. How's life? You are very deeply staring into my eyes. And you're worrying me. And... Jeez. Oh, no. Hey, I don't believe I've made your acquaintance. The name is Beetle, but you can call me... Actually, let's just stick with Beetle. But even if you forget my face, you can remember me by my beetle-shaped backpack. Despite these dangerous times, you'll find me traveling all over Hyrule to fulfill your shopping needs. I stock many special bugs that must have items for travels, travelers, and always charge a fair price, or my name's not Beetle. I also buy all sorts of things. 
If you're in need of rupees, gemstones in particular, fetch a high price. I can help you today. What do you got? I'm sure I have something you'll find useful. Please, take a look. Okay, so we can buy arrows. We can find a Thunderwing Butterfly. I got 29 rupees, so Tireless Frog. Can't get it anyway, but it's there. Oh, so if you cook that with monster parts, you can avoid electricity. That'd be pretty good. Sadly, Beetle, I don't think I have anything to buy. Look what I've got. Okay. Well, what about the amber? A fossilized resin with a caramel sheen. We could get some rupees for that. Precious blue gem mine. Oh wow, you could get 260 rupees for that thing. I'm selling that. Yeah. Um, anything else? Like, I, I do got an opal. We'll sell it. Trying to get some rupees. All right. I should really buy something from him, though. I want to buy the Thunderwing Butterfly. Or the X Electric Donor. Or the Tireless Frog. Oh, that's for stamina. You know, we're get, we got to get the uh, frog. Yeah, we'll buy a frog. Thank you, Beetle. Hope to see you again. Man, wasn't I supposed to go and do shrines? I got sidetracked so real right now. Welcome. Will you be staying with us? A regular bed will cost you 20 rupees. A soft bed is 40. What's a soft bed? Soft bed is a special bed we're proud to offer here at the stable. It costs more than a regular bed, but you'll help... Oh, it, it's like healing, but the other one's not so healing. I, I don't need to sleep. It's like turning day anyway. Okay, where is the, um, that one thing I saw? The horses. So we got the goats over here. What happens if you attack a, that chicken, though? I mean, traditionally in a Zelda game, chickens are a very bad thing to attack. Yep. Bad idea. Bad idea. Bad idea. Bad idea. Bad idea. Dudes, let me in the building, please. Oh, I shouldn't have done it. Oh, yep. Chickens. 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 Oh. Oh. Hi there. Can you save me from the foul... I'm, like, impaling this horse on the head. Okay, chickens, guys. Chickens. Let's not... Oh, wait, yeah, you know what? Where's that shrine? Because if this place is always set up right here. Oh, hey. What is, what's up? Cuisine lovely enough to be favored by the Herulean family. Royal family, if the recipe still exists, I'd love to try. I'll, I'll, I'll do that when I can. Okay, well, if we finish this um, right here. Oh, wait. I always scare these birds away. Yeah, whoops. Thought I could have, like, sniped him. But no, if we can clear this uh, Wago Kata shrine. Look at that. There's a fox. Look at him. The nature show. He's like some weird camera guy. <gasps> Look at him. What's he doing? I love how sidetracking this game is. It's ridiculous how si much sidetracking it can be. Like, I just lose my focus. I was just about to walk into the shrine, and then I saw a fox. What's up? I sure like dogs. 
Don't waste your time trying to climb cliffs in the rain. That's a bit of old rule wisdom I'm sharing with you. Rainy days make the rocks slippery and hard to climb, so it's best to forget about it for the day and stick to flat land. Thanks, Endai. Is that your name, Endai? So what's up? Do you want to be my new best friend? Your horse has spots. How is that possible? Do you know that one guy that's in the tent over here? He was flirting with me. He was really calling me beautiful. He was calling me beautiful. I don't know if that is a form of flirting or not. Where are you going? Dude, do you want to go help me fight giant rocks? You look like you'd be tough enough to do it. Come on, me and you? That, that sounds like a lot of fun. Me and you, come on. Let's, let's go fight rocks together. Beetle, where are you going? I'm like this weird and annoying guy that just doesn't leave. Hey, Beetle. Hey, Beetle. Come one, come all. Well, he sure looks like Beetle. Okay, anyway. Dude, I'm gonna be in a shrine, okay? See you later. I'm gonna do this because I need to mark down this area so I can constantly warp here. Because this is a nice place to warp to if I need it to, like, buy some wares from Beetle or, you know. Wait, actually, hang on a second. Is Beetle marked on my map? Oh, no, that's the Riverside Stable. Okay. It's really nice that that's marked on my map for me, though. Now we'll, I'll know exactly where to warp to to get there quick. Like, I'll know which shrine to look at. Huh. That's handy. Meeting Beetle was pretty cool. This episode was pretty cool. I really enjoyed this one. This was a good one. Now let me deal with this shrine. To you who sets foot in this shrine, I am Wago Kata. In the name of the goddess Hylia, I offer this trial. Me metal connections. Wago Kata shrine. Okay, so if it's going to be about metal, I'm going to assume we need the magnet. Yep. Okay, so I won't drop it on me this time. Okay, so how would I go about getting up there? I... I mean, I guess if I grab... Okay, here's the problem here. Yeah, that was what the problem was. Okay, let's push that like that. I, I guess I probably didn't need to mess with them at all. Oh, wow, I, I bear. Oh, I almost fell. Wow, we're hitting like 30 minutes on this video. I gotta wrap it up. I don't like to make them go this long. Unless you guys are okay with them being around for 30 minutes. I'm trying to be keeping them 20 to 25. But if they go to 30, it's because I just kept getting sidetracked all episode. I really only need the one. Okay, so that's the exit. So what's up here then? I, I'll check this first. Okay, I guess we just kind of do the same thing we did before. Just better than what I just did there. Yeah, I need all three.
Okay. Wait. Wait. Okay. Um, I can grab this. But what would that do? Okay. Easy. Last but not least, I need this board. Pretty much I need it hanging over. And oh no. That is not anywhere near what I wanted that to do. I need an opening to get up. Why does that not work? Oh, I can't grab it now, can I? No, I can. Okay, okay, okay. I'm getting up there as soon as I can. <sighs> okay. All I wanted to do. That's it. That's all I wanted to do, game. You made that so difficult. Or I did. Someone made it difficult to climb that thing. And it wasn't even supposed to be. Dude, look at his hat. <laughs> Can I have a hat like that? That'd be cool. I don't even understand these guys. They're just weird. They're all different. Which is, I mean, good. It's not like it's the same thing over and over. So I'm very glad that they're at least different looking every time. I, I'm like the first few. Yeah. Goddesses. Smiling. Watching over. Whatever you said. I don't know. I'm Link. I don't pay attention. I just keep doing things. Okay, we need to end this episode. I didn't think that shrine was going to take that long. I didn't realize it was going to get sidetracked by horses and getting attacked by cuckoos. I didn't think I was going to run into Beetle. It was a very productive day. So, yeah. And it's like night now almost. It's like evening. So that's pretty much it though. I hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, definitely show your support. Hit that like button. And subscribe for more. Uh, Breath of the Wild. That's the name. Man, I like that there's music right here. It's, it makes it really cool. <gasps> A fish! Okay, one last thing before we end off. I want to catch that fish. Rawr! Staminoko, Staminoka Bass. Meaning it's going to heal all. Oh, okay, that's good for when it comes to needing stamina. Okay, but seriously, done with the episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Sure you supported that like button. Thank you if you do so. Subscribe for more Breath of the Wild. And I'll see you guys next time. Alright, bye.